the Voluntarist Declaration of Independence. Yes, please! Brought to you by LibertyUnderAttack.com and AgorisNexus.com. We, the Libertarians, Voluntarists, Individualists, and Anti-Federalists, join now in unison and make a declaration that the natural rights that are supposed to be protected by the United States federal government are in such fullness of violation by said government that an ultimatum is merited in response. We stand here today to denounce the wholesale erosion of individual liberty, an erosion more egregious than even under the King of England and feudal lords. We note these violations in specificity and name them for what they are, infringements. Our right to own property is infringed due to property taxes which turn ownership into a perpetual lease from the state. Our right to our physical body is violated with the war on drugs as the government uses force against people for what they choose to ingest. Our right to privacy is infringed due to a full-take spying system where communications are collected and stored for empowering tyranny. Our right to bear arms and to self-defense is infringed due to the passing of laws which turn the right into a privilege and criminalize peaceful people defending their homes. More than half of our income is taken by force at a rate far beyond that which was faced under the British crown. Our children are enslaved to a central bank and a national debt which has been carefully crafted to enrich those in power while slowly putting future generations into poverty through inflation and debt to the Federal Reserve Bank. Our right to travel freely on public and unknown land has been infringed upon with licenses, permits, and perpetual fees. Our right to be free from unreasonable searches and seizures has been undermined with lowered standards, special exceptions, and secret courts with secret trials. Our right to due process has been infringed upon with civil asset forfeiture and special ex parte hearings where judges and prosecutors agree to seize property without a crime having first been charged. Our right to free speech has been attacked under special exceptions by not treating speech as sovereign within the context of property rights. Our children have been brainwashed to love central planning and socialism through the mandate of compulsory schooling laws, and adults have been forced to fund these institutions regardless of parenthood. Soldiers have been stationed abroad in unending wars, maintaining standing armies that have created blowback which endangers us. Our politicians and leaders have been caught engaging repeatedly in companionship and participation with pedophiles and rapists and have exempted themselves from scrutiny by hiding evidence and offing witnesses. For these reasons, we hereby declare that our consent is clearly and unequivocally revoked from any support of the federal government and we the people take back our sovereign right to rule our lives and ourselves. We also emphatically proclaim that taxation is indeed theft, and the power to tax has proven itself a power to destroy. There can be no power to tax where there is not also a throne for the vilest people to gain power and upend the precious liberties we hold dear. We declare that any form of taxation is itself a violation of the natural rights of man, and that any supposed government cannot ethically exist save through individual consent and voluntary support. The notion of the social contract is a lie purported by those in power to justify their rule. We resist any who dare to claim a power to rule by unilateral decree. We resist claims that some small group may take from people a portion of their income by force for the act of being born, living on land, and earning income. With this declaration, we now state our intent to hold accountable those who have chosen to oppress the American people with their frauds and force, and to one day form a new nation of those committed to the principles of liberty, those who refuse to initiate force against others by respecting individual consent and property rights. We understand that expatriation is not viewed favorably by the federal government, but we will not back down from our secession movement when our lives and livelihoods are being held hostage under a system of statutory tyranny. If you hear this message and you agree with us, you are a part of the resistance. Join us now as we pave the way for a truly free future. Thank you for watching and supporting my work. And a special thank you to all of my fiducers, Shane Radliff of Liberty Under Attack Publications, Agoras Nexus, The Asian Capitalists, Crawford K. McDonald of ECM Real Estate, and Zach Lekowski. Help me produce more quality content and receive special perks for your monthly support by joining my Patreon, Subscribestar, or Float pages. See you soon! Yes, freeze!